Hey hi hello namaste welcome to CR Entity Designers this is Chetan and in this tutorial we are going to create a decorative design so you can find this kind of designs in a variety of places like jewelry so if you are new on this youtube channel then don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and now let's get started to make the design we need to add a circle so shift a and then add a circle and we will go with the 24 words then rotate the circle into the 90 degree and then you need to add the lattice so add the lattice and then scale it down that lattice and give the size to the lattice as per the size of the circle and make sure that lattice should be a little bit bigger than your circle so adjust the size of the lattice in the object mode then select the circle and you need to increase the resolution of the lattice a little bit okay then select the circle and then add a lattice modifier on the circle and select that lattice then select the lattice and go to the edit mode and then select the stop words and then rotate them into the 90 degree and then select the bottom words and then rotate them into the opposite 90 degree and here we want to create a twist so that's why i wrote them into the opposite 90 degree okay now you can see we got the infinity from the top view and you can see we got the twist on that circle then you can apply that lattice modifier so just select the circle and then apply that lattice modifier and then you can delete that lattice now select the circle go to the edit mode select everything and press f to fill the gap and now we need to add the screw modifier so just add the screw modifier and choose the proper axis for the screw modifier you can see we are getting the variations with the different axis but in this case x axis will work fine so choose the x-axis and if I go to the little bit inside of that object then you can see press the 3 for the face selection and you can see there is a face and we don't want any face at there from the inner side so that's why we need to delete the few words so just select this word and then x and then delete these words so we won't get face just if I turn off that screw modifier then you can see one curve spiral curve as there and which help us to create this form then you need to apply that latter uh, screw modifier so just apply that screw modifier and now you can see there are double words and we need to merge the words so select everything and then press m and merge by distance so we can merge the double words you can see there then select these edges so shift select these edges And after that you need to press B, Ctrl B to add the bevel on them and add a bevel. And add the bevel with the two segment bevel is fine. So select these edges and then Ctrl B to add the bevel, give the right bevel width. So add the lookers like this at the center of these faces. After that you need to select these edge loops. So shift select these edge loops and then you need to scale down them along their normal. You can press Alt S to scale them along their normal. And you can see we got the decent form there so just you need to add subdim surface modifier before adding the subd modifier just select these faces and press i for the insert operation and use the insert operation one more time and then right click and then loop tool and then loft option select these faces press i for the insert operation and then you can add few more loop cuts right there so control R and then add a loop cut like this and now we need to add the sublime surface modifier so add that sub D modifier you can see the face loop structure which we have created and we have tried to maintain the chord based topology on the model so add the sub D modifier and increase count up to 2 and shade smooth it and there you go it's look decent and you can see we have created that decorative design so thanks for watching if you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe our youtube channel bye bye see the next video take care